Hi, welcome back to my channel. This is Carrie here of um, Charisma Tips at YouTube. And thank you so much for watching. Two things going on today. I'm going to be starting a series. First thing is today's April the 1st and I joined a challenge called Vita, which is a video every day in April. So I will be showing, hopefully, if I stick to my plan, I will be um, producing a video every day for this month. And the second thing is each week I'll have a theme. So this week the theme is going to be products in my professional kit. So today I'm going to talk about the foundations in my kit. So the foundations that I use the most frequently in my professional kit are, one of them is this Becca Ultimate Coverage Complexion Cream A. I'm sure if you've seen any of my recent videos you're not surprised it's a Becca, it's a Becca product. It comes in a tube like this. I actually have never told anybody this before, but a makeup artist here in town that I look up to, she's a, she's just someone I look up to, she's a great artist. I asked her some advice and she told me to look into this brand. And so I contacted them to see what colors would be good for my artist kit. Because in a kit you need to have warms and cools. You don't need to have all the colors, but a good variety of warms and cool undertones so that you can custom blend. And they actually sent me 14 of the 20 colors of this foundation. So that is really why I'm a huge Becca fan and they didn't ask me to promote or anything like that. And I purchased two other colors just to complete my kit. I really like this for clients because you know Atlanta gets so hot for so long. Most of my clients are special occasion clients or bridal clients and they need their makeup to last all day and they also need their makeup to combat against sweat and also combat against the humidity. This um, foundation, don't quote me, but I believe it's 25% pigment. It's a water-based um, It's a water -based, uh, foundation, and it doesn't have any parabens or anything that will clog your pores. So it's a very good hyperallergenic uh, product, and since it is so highly pigmented, a little bit goes a long way. So you don't need that much. So for the client, it doesn't feel real heavy on her skin. But then it gives you that, that airbrush finish that everybody likes when you get your makeup professionally done. And it'll last all day. So this is my number one that I go to. And the second one that I go to is partially because it was uh, created by a makeup artist. A makeup artist that I got to actually meet in person. His name is AJ Crimson. And this is actually his brand. It's called AJ Crimson. And he has three different pro palettes. This is for the dark complexion ladies or gents. This is for the lighter complexion folks. And then this is also a, um, uh, a kit to help with uh, highlights and contours and undertones and blending and all that good stuff. So I use this kit primarily, I use this for usually people that don't have to worry about sweatiness. If they don't have to, if they have to worry about sweatiness or oiliness, then I will stick with the Becca. If that's not something that they have to worry about and if, like, if they don't need to look great for 10 plus hours, then I will go with this. So this is usually for clients that maybe are a little bit younger, don't have as much mature skin. Um, maybe a senior photo shoot, a, um, a boudoir photo shoot, um, someone with drier skin. Uh, those are the types of people that I use as people that prefer creams. And um, it's designed by an African American artist, so the African American colors. It's just got a very wide range of darker tones. So for mixing purposes as artists, it's really easy to use. So um, there you have it. Those are the two foundations that, I, that are my go-to for my kit. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. I'd love to hear your comments below if you have any questions. And um, stay tuned for tomorrow because I will be talking about eyeshadows.